Hi, I'm Ajahn's Vonder Plantis, nutritionist. Been a nutritionist and drinking raw milk for a lot of years. Now, if you listen to the health department and doctors who know nothing about health, they know nothing about nutrition, they know nothing about diet, yet they will tell you this little glass of milk will crawl out with all these things and take over your body like the blob and will kill you. Well, I was dying of cancer of the blood, bone, stomach, and lymphatic system. I went through surgeries, chemo, and radiation. I was a worm on the floor. My teeth were dangling in my gums because the radiation therapy deteriorated the bone and gave me bone cancer. This little thing right here, which was suggested by a volunteer from the hospice, 18-year-old boy, said drink raw milk. And if you've ever had chemo and radiation, you know that everything tastes like postage stamp glue and cardboard after that. Milk, raw milk, was the only thing that tasted good. And with a year, all of my bone regenerated around my teeth and saved my teeth. They wanted to pull all of my teeth because they dangled in my gums and I was losing... Uh, quite a bit of blood every week and getting one to two transfusions weekly. This little monster here that the government wants you to believe is bad is a wonderful healthful substance. I drink two quarts minimum daily. I have patients who have been disease stricken with everything you can imagine and they are in the so-called high risk category recover by drinking milk. Sure, a few people have some allergies to it, but all of those people with allergies, it's mainly allergies to pasteurized dairy. Pasteurized dairy creates epidemics. Anytime they blame this raw milk for disease, it's not scientifically. What they do is it's by survey. Doctor, the hospital calls the health department and said, oh, we had somebody who had bloody diarrhea or vomit. So the health department gives it to some clerk, some employee, that calls the person who got sick, maybe three weeks, six months later, and asks them what they ate. Who's going to remember what they ate yesterday, much less three to three weeks to six months later? If that person says they drink raw milk, that will get blamed for it. That's science? No, that's not science. In fact, there was one case that the state of California reported as a 12-year-old girl dying of raw milk who drowned. So it was later discovered when, they, when some less prejudicial people called to investigate called the family of the dead girl and found out she was the only family, one in the family that didn't drink raw milk. So you can't even blame her, not even remotely, her drowning from drinking raw milk. But that is the situation. Raw milk is not a danger. It's not like playing Russian roulette. These are people who know nothing that say that. These are people who live in textbooks and with chemistry data. They have no empirical knowledge. Raw milk is nothing but good and I'm going to drink it my entire life. I'm 65 and I was supposed to be dead at 21. This helped save my life. So don't listen to them. Enjoy the raw milk. Get healthy. Mm. So delicious and rich.